Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to Auschamps webinar. Today, an update on visas, very important topic uh, for expats like us living in Thailand. We've had uh, some interesting things going on with visas. There's a, uh, a moratorium till the 31st of July, but what does that really mean? And, and the only way to deal with this is really to go to the experts and get them to give us an update. Uh, Kun Penrook Pet Petmani from Tiliki Gibbons. Uh, this is her area of expertise. Hi, good afternoon, everyone. Penrook from um, Tiliki Gibbons. It was my pleasure to be part of seminar today. So my presentation today, we cover the work permit and visa extension and how to deal with the extension during the COVID-19, general information on work permit and visa, and a short update on the TM30 or a report of residents about the visa relief measures during the COVID-19. First time it's the visa extension, they allow person to stay here without going to the immigration office, submit documents, you can stay at your place because Thai government avoid um, crowded people at immigration check, uh, at immigration bureau. They rarely have a news or even regulation about the work permit, of course, because there is no relief on the work permit extension. This is one point that you have to, to be careful. But effective June 30 this year, the immigration office gives some relaxation on the TM30 they only allow you to just submit for the first time when people, when foreigners stay at your place. And then if that person might have trip, I mean, overseas trip or any trip to Hua Hin or to Phuket and then return and stay at the same place, the landlord do not need to submit every time they return. But the 